Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So since Chili finally uploaded the first part of the video from Apple Valley, I'm going to go ahead and review that one. Since it's not fair to review the second half of it and not the first half. I'm still not sure why he didn't even upload the whole video, why he chose only to upload the last 17 minutes. Um, maybe it was because he's more erratic than normal. I don't know. Like, he really is more erratic than normal in the beginning of this video. He's screaming out case law as usual that he gets wrong. He's just a complete idiot. And at this point, I think he's honestly looking for a way to get shot by the police so that he can do a huge lawsuit and try and, try and get money that way. Um, it sure looks that way to me. Even though he'd lose still, and he'd only have a bullet hole to remind him of what an idiot he is, he's. it looks like that's what he's trying to do. Anyways, I hope you enjoy the video. When I see a copper, I just go right by him. And I just always make sure that they know. So, like, it doesn't matter how fast I go by. I just always drive by. Just, just, just let them know I'm filming him. Just let them know I'm getting a good look at him there. That's how I roll. Just like that. Just let him know I'm watching him. Let him know he's being filmed. It doesn't matter if, if uh, he's doing anything or not. You just want to let him know you're filming him. Always let him know you're filming him. Always let him know you're filming him. Go here. I've already brought this up and, and mentioned it and showed it in the last video. But in the state of California, you cannot use a cell phone or similar electronic communication device while holding it in your hand. You can only use it in a hands-free manner, such as speakerphone or voice commands, but never while holding it. Any driver under the age of 18 is prohibited from using a cell phone for any reason. So again, it's California traffic law. I don't understand how hard this is for him to figure out. Now, he's trying to say it's because it's a camera. Now, you've got his idiot subscribers on his channel posting, it's a camera, not a phone. No, dumbasses. It's a phone. It is a mobile phone with a camera attached to it. So, yes, he can be pulled over and ticketed for literally holding his mobile phone in his hand while he's driving. He's also baiting this cop. Watch and see. Copper, you see that copper still right over there? Just let them know we're watching them. And just always let them know. Keep an eye on them. So I'm just pulled over here just to just to film them. And let them know I got him. He saw me pull around over here. Just let them know. Just let them know. There's a camera on him. He won't stay very long. I guarantee you, he pulls out of there. He won't be able to handle it this one over here filming him. How long it is, do you think? Away. He's driving away. He sat there for less than a minute, about one minute before he had to drive away. Oh, but copper. I'm a member of the press. I keep track of cops because you guys can't be trusted. You're the devils in the night. You're the demons in the in the day. You're the evil. You're the fear. You're the death. So I ain't done filming you, copper. Was... Chili is so high in this video. Like, you can tell in his eyes, of course, as usual. But his behavior is way worse than normally. And you can hear him. Like, what is he pretending like he's in some kind of movie that's literally being filmed, produced, and everything by his own mind. I mean, that's what it sounds like he's doing. So now he has such a low life that he's driving around pretending to be in movies in his mind while beating police and trying to get shot. Like, none of this is making any sense. The police need to arrest him and he needs to be Baker acted for 72 hours for a mental instability. That's what needs to happen with Chili. Period. I mean, we need to get him off the street. 
He should not be allowed to drive around. He's a reckless driver. He doesn't care about anybody else on the road. He's going to kill somebody on the road. He's definitely going to kill somebody on the road. Or hurt somebody. I mean, heck, all of this takes place in this video. It all takes place in front of a high school. He doesn't care. He does not care. He doesn't care about anybody but himself. He doesn't care about his subscribers. He doesn't care about the people on the road. He doesn't care about pedestrians. He doesn't care about people that he uses and grifts off of. He only cares about himself. The cops don't give two shits that you're recording them. They are. They don't care. They record us. They don't care. Sorry, my cat is using his little scratch box. They don't care. What they do care about is that you're using your phone in your hand while you're driving. That's what they care about. Down here again and take another left. So that means if I want to intercept him, I'm probably going to have to go right over this way because he's probably going to come up. If I'm guessing, he's probably going to come up right here. He's probably going to come up right here. Either on this street here. Is this the street he's going to come up on? Because he flipped a -E. I don't see any piggy coming up the street right there. So he passed this one most likely. And then we got a car here. Stop signs. He's going to stop right here. But then as we come up here, that piggy. That piggy. Let's see where that piggy went. Let's see where the pig went. No, no pig down there. Let's see where the piggy went. No piggy down that side. There's a truck up there, but I don't see a pig. Let me see if this is... No pig. You know, if he didn't come up this way... I don't see that pig coming this way. That was look beautiful. Just look in the mirror. You'll find your pig. Come down here. Let me see if I got a piggy over here. Because he had to go. So he may have gone down and taken a right. Because he would. Oh, there he is. There he is. There he is. What I say? I got him right there. Right there. Right there's a pig. Right there. Right there's a pig. Right there. Just let that piggy know. Got an eye on you, pig. Keep an eye on you, piggy. Let's see if I can... Let's see how that piggy does. How does piggy do? Got a yellow light right here. I'm just going to make it through that yellow light. Like a glove. I mean, this is literally what Chili has lowered himself to, that if a police officer doesn't give him the attention he's seeking right away, he will hunt them down until they do give him attention. And he wants the attention so he can get out and scream and yell at somebody because when he's that high, he needs to be able to yell and scream. And more than likely, whoever's couch he's grifting off of that night, they're not going to let him sit there and yell and scream in their house. Now, supposedly, he is in Apple Valley for a funeral for his cousin who died of fentanyl. And it seems that Chile knows an awful lot of people dying of over overdoses. That tells you about Chile. But <clears throat> you spend your time baiting police and getting high when you're supposed to be somewhere for a funeral for someone who overdosed on drugs. Like, <sighs> do you see why Chili needs to be locked up? He needs to be locked up. He's one of those people that should be locked up for a very long time. All I'm doing is keeping track of the pig because, as you know, the pig is the most dangerous animal on earth. The There's nothing fuck? more dangerous than a pig. Absolutely nothing more dangerous than a pig. We know that. We, we've we seen it. And now he took a right right here. I'm just keeping an eye on a pig. That's what I do. I film, I film coppers in their official capacity. That's what I do. And that's what he's doing is he's, uh, he's driving around. Hang on one second here. Let me turn my blink.
No, Chili, what you're doing is you're following around a, an actual alpha male who has a job, who is doing his job while you drive around following him high off your ass, wishing you can be as good as him. You are so jealous of police. It's clear. It, it like It's soaking out of your body the jealousy you have for police officers. Because you wanted to be one so bad, but could not pass the mental exam. And now you hate them. We know it's not because you got pulled over for walking home drunk at 18. You're an idiot if you think anybody's going to believe a police officer literally handcuffed you and took you to jail because you were walking home drunk at 18. Unless you were doing something really stupid like screaming or threatening people or breaking people's windows or doing whatever in the process. Like, you don't just get handcuffed and arrested at 18 walking home drunk. Just walking. You're an idiot. Just be honest. You're jealous that the police would not let you join the force, and that's why you behave this way. Made you accountable for the crimes you have committed over and over and over and over, and it pisses you off because you couldn't talk your way out of it because you're not that smooth of a talker. This is why you don't like police and you blame them because you're a jobless loser. It's not their fault that you can't put down the pipe and pick up a pen and get a job. Just filming that pig. Just going to slow down here real slow, real slow. Just let them know. I got to just let them know. I got a beat on them. I'm just watching them right there. That's all I'm doing. Just got a beat on the pig. Let's see. Oh, sure. Now, I'm going to warn you, if you have volume up or you're wearing headphones, be prepared for some really cringy music and chilly screaming. Just wanted to warn you before I played this part of the video. Coppers pulling me over. You pulling me over for no reason? You better know your place, Copper. You better know your place. Your car, sir. No, sir, that's Pennsylvania versus Mims. The 1977 holding. No, no. You're using your vehicle. You're no, using your no, phone no. while driving a motor vehicle. California the back Supreme car, Court has already stated that I can use I can hold car. my don't, don't put your hands on me, bro. I'm a constitutional law scholar. I'm just not okay. some regular okay. person. Okay. I'm in town for a funeral. Okay. So you here's what you can do. You can get in your car and you can get the fuck out of here. Pack your that's your license, sir. No. You can't see shit. Hold on. Because you're out of order right now. Name a badge number. One's a pair. Okay, so I'm going to file a complaint against you. Good. And if you touch me, mother... I'm going to file a lawsuit. Now get back in your car. Head on out of here. Head on out of here. Take a hike. Unless you want to... Like no. You're violating my rights right now. I'm a constitutional law scholar. So here's Chili yet again yelling out case law that he has no clue what he's talking about because he doesn't understand case law when he reads it. Pennsylvania versus Mims is a Supreme Court criminal law decision holding that a police officer ordering a person out of a car following a traffic stop and conducting a pat down to check for weapons did not violate the Fourth Amendment to the United States Constitution. When did this police officer ask him to get out of his car so he could pat him down and check him for weapons? Not even once. He told Chili to get back in his car because he doesn't know what Chili's capable of doing. He doesn't know that Chili, you know, if Chili's going to come at him or sh hit him or shoot him or whatever. You can already see that Chili's mentally unstable, so he's not sure what Chili's going to do. But Chili starts yelling out Pennsylvania versus Mims like it means something. It means nothing to him. Just like when he tries to use Terry Stop later on in the video which I've already covered that part. He has no clue what he's talking about when he talks about laws or case law or the Constitution. I don't understand how his followers don't see this. It, it, oh, he, he's so dumb. 
But then again, he's also so incredibly high in this video that I'm surprised he even remembers the name of his channel or his own name. And no, by the way, sorry for the pause. I almost forgot to... He's not a constitutional law scholar. We all know that. Right, I can report you. That's right. You're a dumb... You don't know the laws. Get your captain out here. I'll be, I'll be out with one. I'm going to go to Hills High School. You ain't out with anybody, bro. You're in big trouble. Okay. I'm going to file a complaint first, and then second, I'll file a lawsuit against you. Now go back in your car, little dog. Suffer. Go follow orders. Go on. Go on. They want today to be the last day? Is today the last day for both of us? Because I'm not going to accept an unlawful arrest. Okay. Just I, want you know that. Okay. I know you're not. You're going to go back in your back of your car like the little dog you are. Are you done? Get the f*** out of here. You pulled me over for no reason. Get the f*** out of my face. Are you done, sir? Go on, beta male. Go on. Code six. I'm code four. Code four? Is this a code four? Yeah. And you pulled someone over for no good reason? Do you know the California State Supreme Court statue on holding my phone in my hand when I drive? Do you know what it is? They said that if I can't hold my phone in my hand, then essentially it becomes a paperweight. Did you know that? Did you know the California State Supreme Court holdings? Do you want to see it? Do you want to see it? Like, we all know that Chili talks to police officers like that. And it's all, again, based off of jealousy. He's jealous of police officers because they told him no, he couldn't join the force because he was mentally unstable. Now, if you notice right towards the end of the clip how bad he's shaking, because he knows he's wrong. This, like, if you can, I've already pinpointed, and I'm an expert now. I will call myself an expert now. I'm pinpointing when Chili's lying or when he's terrified of, his, of anything, when he knows he's wrong. He knows he's wrong in this video. He knows this. But he's doing it because if he doesn't do it, his subscribers are not going to give him money. So he's willing to get out and risk an arrest. Even though he's terrified of getting arrested, he's going to do it so that he can get money from his subscribers. If you notice towards the end of, end of the clip, watch his phone. He's shaking so bad that he almost loses his phone. It almost falls out of his hand. That's why he starts backing off a little bit. You'll notice how he calms down through the through this video. Um, he calms down a lot more in the one that I've already covered, but he starts to calm down in this one because he knows he's wrong. He knows he's wrong, but he's never going to admit it because if he does, or he gives even one small hint, that he knows he's wrong, then his subscribers will not give him money anymore. I gotta reach in here now. You're not gonna be, you're not gonna be scared, are you? You sure you're not scared? I'm not scared. Okay. So this right here, you don't have a right to pull me over. Well, wait, what, what? No, you don't. No, you don't. Number one, I can stop anywhere I want, any street I want, I can go anywhere I want. But you don't have a right to pull. Oh no, he pulled out the indestructible trifold. For what, Tilly? For what? That trifold's not going to save you. It's not going to save you for anything in this incident or any incident that you end up in. It's not going to save you. It's full of shit. That whole thing. You put the case law on there perfectly fine. And then once you put fact, then you've completely screwed it up because you think that your opinion is fact when it's not. That trifold is crap. You are literally selling people shit. You're selling them lies. You're selling them your opinions. And I've already proven it. In what, two or three videos, I've proven that your trifold is nothing but lies. But you're going to pull it up, pull it up. And, and guess what? This cop can even tell that you're full of shit. He can look at the trifold and tell you're full of shit. No. And the first one he opens it up to is parking parking anywhere he wants to. Um, except on an interstate or a highway dump. Number one, I can stop anywhere I want, any street I want. I can go anywhere I want. But you don't have a right to pull me over for no reason. I'll be on a T-stop in front of the school. A T-stop? Yeah. What's that? Should I, should I run live here real quick? Is that what I should do? Should I run live real fast just to make sure you're not going to be a tyrant? Okay, let me. I'm going to pause this real quick. I'm going to run live just so this jackboot thug tyrant pulled me over for no good reason. 
Am I being detained or am I free to go? Oh, well, uh, well, under which under which ordinance or statute am I being detained under? What's your What's your single articulable fact that I've committed a crime? What is it? What's the vehicle code? I can't hold my phone in my hand. I just educated you. California Supreme Court says I can't hold my phone in my hand. Oh really? Oh really? Let's let, let's see. Pull it up. Pull up the statute. I don't have the statute with me right now. Well then, let's see it. You pulled me over for no reason. I can't look it up right now. I gotta film you, bro. You're the most dangerous pig on earth. You're the most dangerous thing on earth, bro. You think you're a good person? I think so. You signed up to a Death Star. You drag people off to a dungeon. I if know. you could right now, would you drag me off to a dungeon? Why would I do that, sir? Because you're a pig, bro. Because okay. you signed up to hurt people. You pulled me over for no good reason. Okay. You're wasting my time. You're wasting your time. Most of all, bro, if you violate my rights, I will sue the shit out of you, dude. You have your license? I'm not giving you a This is an unlawful stop. Okay. This is an unlawful... You pulled me over because I looked at you. No. You didn't know no. my phone was running or not. My phone's in my hand. In your hand, exactly. So I can hold my phone in my hand. How do you know I was recording you? You said so. Yeah. So I was pointing my head, my phone pointing at you. So that means I was recording. You sure about that, copper? I got an inside dash cam. You know, I'm right sure. And I got a back dash cam too. You literally pulled me over because I was because I had my phone in my hand. Exactly. Right. And that, that's not a statute. Show it to me. It is in the view. Show it to me. You're holding your hand while operating. More. Show it to me. Let me see it. Let me see it. I'm not getting in there, bro. You want me to show it to you? It's Pennsylvania versus Memphis. Do you know what it is? The what's reason the why I, I have to get out of my car is for what? Again, Chili proving he does not know or understand any facts given to him. He is just sitting here throwing a tantrum on purpose so that he can get content for a video. That's all this is about. The officer did have the right to pull you over. California does say that having your phone in your hand while driving is illegal, so he pulled you over for a legal stop. You are an idiot, Chili. What's the vehicle code? I can't hold my phone in my hand. I just educated you. California Supreme Court says I can't hold my phone in my hand. Oh, really? Oh, really? Let's, let, let's see. Pull it up. Pull up the statute. I don't have the statute with you right now. Well, then let's see it. You pulled me over for no reason. You can look it up in your car. I can't look it up right now. I got to film you, bro. You're the most dangerous pig on earth. You're the most dangerous thing on earth, bro. You think you're Let's see. Pull it up. Pull up the statute. Let's read this here. Spriggs contends. Or, I'm sorry. Subdivision A, which prohibits drivers from using a wireless telephone unless that telephone is specifically designed and configured to allow hands-free listening and talking and is used in the manner while driving. It does not matter if it's turned on or whatever. You pointed it right there in the cop's face with it in your hand. It was a hand-free wireless telephone or uh a hands-free wireless telephone. Therefore, he legally pulled you over. I don't have a statue with you right now. Well, then let's see it. You pulled me over for no reason. Yep. You can look it up in your car. I can't look it up right now. I got to film you, bro. You're the most dangerous yeah, pig on earth. You're the most dangerous thing on earth, bro. You think you're a good person? I think so. You signed up to a Death Star. You drag people off to a dungeon. I if know. you could right now, would you drag me off to a dungeon? Why would I do that, sir? Because you're a pig, bro. Because you signed up to hurt people. You pulled me over for no good reason. You're wasting my time. You're wasting your time. Most of all, bro, if you violate my rights, I will sue the shit out of you, dude. You have your license? I'm not giving you a This is an unlawful stop. Okay. This is an unlawful... You pulled me over because I looked at you. No. You didn't know if my phone was running or not. My phone's in my hand. Exactly. So I can hold my phone in my hand. How do you know I was recording you? So I was pointing my head, my phone pointing at you. So that means I was recording. You sure about that, copper? I got an inside dash cam. You know I'm right sure, and I got a back dash cam too. You literally pulled me over because I was because I had my phone in my hand. Exactly. Right, and that, that's not a statute. Show it to me. It is in the vehicle. Show it to me. You're holding your hand while operating. More. Show it to me. Let me see it. Let me see it. I'm not getting in there, bro. You want me to show it to you? It's Pennsylvania versus Memphis. Do you know what it is? The reason why I I have to get out of my car is for what? For what? For officer safety. And yet again, Tilly talks about Pennsylvania versus Mims without understanding the case law. Again. Without any kind of worry, because I'm a law abiding citizen. But what I'm saying to you is, you unlawfully pulled me over. Me you pulled, you, yeah, let's see it. Go ahead, okay. take, take your time. Right, Dude, I'm not an attack dog. I'm not going to attack you, man. I'm not into, I'm not into uh, committing felonies. Last I checked, I'm almost 50 years old. I've never committed one so far. So I'm not going to, you can even turn your back on me, bro. I'm not going to attack you, dude. I just don't like pigs. That's fine. You signed up for a Death Star, bro. Okay. You don't get to just pull me over because you don't like that you could be on camera. That's not how it works, dude. And if it is, I'll challenge it all the way up to the Supreme Court. Just give me a second, all right? Whatever you need, buddy. 
You pulled me over because you don't like being filmed. Just plain as day. You can't give these pigs an inch. I mean, it's just, it's just the worst. Here comes another pig coming in hot. Oh man, another pig got his lights on. It's an emergency. It's an emergency. We got piggy number two. Piggy number two is coming in hot. <laughs> is a guy with two cameras here, man. You better hurry. You better hurry, piggy. There's a guy with two cameras here. He's got two cameras. Hurry, come in hot. Come in hot. Get your gun out. Let's get hands on, boys. Grab this guy fast. He's got a camera on me. He's got a camera on me. I'm so scared. I'm a scared little copper. I'm so scared. He's got a camera, boys. Quick, call for backup. <laughs> What's your mission? Protect the kids from school. <laughs> <laughs> hey y'all listen y'all should always film cops your camera should be out now oh they're the evil they're the ones who will hurt your children this guy's evil he'll hurt your kids this guy will attack your children he's so stupid i i really honestly i can a human being really be this dumb is it humanly possible to be this dumb or do you think he's just acting for his videos so he can grift more money off of his subscribers i mean you've even got this lady in a car pretty much telling him to shut the f up and then when he finally talks to her she literally tells him you should be respectful and he calls her karen because he doesn't even know what a karen is he doesn't know what a Karen is. He doesn't know anything about case law or law or the Constitution. He is a walking contradiction. And he just proves how dumb he is every time he opens his mouth. It just makes no sense. And it's, it, it won't make sense because myself and those of you who watch my videos, we are sane. We are mentally stable. He's not. He never will be. He's 48 years old and he has nothing to show for life other than being a complete loser the entire time he's been alive. That is sad. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed the video. I just wanted to make sure I got the first part out since he waited forever to even upload the first part of the video. He, it's just, he's getting worse. And I've already spoken to the Apple Valley Police Department Chili may want to stay out of Apple Valley. He may really want to stay out of Apple Valley. Before long, we'll have it where he can't go into any city in any state. When, anyway, so if you enjoyed this video, let me know. Uh, I'm working on a couple other non-chili videos. I'll get those out as soon as I can. I'm also still working on my Octifold and my Frauditor Bingo. So I'll let you know when all, all of those are ready to go. I hope you enjoyed the video. I will see you in the next one. Take care. Be safe. I love each and every one of you.